Hi, this is Mr. V. Today I'm going to show you how to add another level to your house in Revit and also how to put in stairs. So the first thing you want to make sure you've done, you've got your first floor, make sure you've got it done, especially these outside walls because that's going to help you line up when you do your second floor. Another thing you need to think about, where do you want your stairs to be? Okay, when I switch from hidden line to realistic, you can see I've already set my floors done most of the furniture. I need to add a kitchen seal and um, one thing you w don't want to do, wait until wait and put your windows in after you've added the second story because you want those to line up so it looks symmetrical. So that's the realistic view. I'm going to switch back to hidden line. It's just a little bit easier instead of seeing all our different flooring materials. So the first thing you've got to do, you've got to make your second level. Okay. So click on Elevation East, and you should, can see the door, the man door I put in the garage. You've got the first floor, zero, second floor, ten foot. So what you've got to do, you're in this architecture tab. If you look over here, you have level. Click that. You're going to start on the left. I'm going to go ahead and go up ten feet because I want my second floor to have ten foot ceilings. Go over. Drag that and it tells you it's 20 feet. Okay. Now I don't like how it calls that level 3, so I'm going to change the name here. My first floor, I'm going to make that say ground. Would you like to rename? Yes. Second floor, I'm going to make that my first floor. Now let's call this second floor. That's okay. Second floor. We'll keep that. In level three, we're just going to name it roof. Okay. So now let's see how that looks. When I click over here on ground, it gives me my bottom floor. First floor click on second floor nothing's there okay because we haven't put those walls but notice how you can see in gray you can see the dimensions of your first floor that I renamed to the ground okay so now I'm going to show you how to add stairs click on your architecture tab over here with your uh, floors and all that that we've done you have stair okay I don't want them right off my front entry, so you got to think about where you where you want to enter it. So let's go about right here, and it's going to let you drag it till it gets to that second floor. Now, if you want to go sideways and make a landing and all that, you can do that as well. But I'm not going to do that. I just want some basic stairs here. So let me go back and start over again. Okay. So I'm going to kind of line it up a little bit with this front entry. And drag them up. And you can see it took 18 risers. And now I'm going to move that over. Get that fine tune. Now let's look at that in 3D view. And you can see I've got the stairs there, but there's no, no floor just yet. Okay, so no walls up here. Um, you can move these however you like. Get them kind of where you think, where you see fit. And you want them close to that wall. Made mine a little bit wider there. So they're touching that wall to the garage. Okay, the next thing you got to do, let's see. So I'm done with the stair. I 
And you can see it put kind of a railing there. That's okay. And you have to practice with these a little bit. Get it just right. Okay. So the next thing you want to do, you've got a whole second floor that you need to, uh, you want to replicate your first floor on the second floor. Okay, now we're going to add the second story, and the gray here is going to really help you while you do this. So you need to go back to your architecture tab. You want to draw walls. Okay, I'm not going to have this little bump out here. That's like a breakfast nook. I'm not going to do that for the second level. So I'm just redoing those walls best I can. Okay, so now I've got my exterior walls. Let's see what that looks like on 3D view. Okay, and you can see the second level there. Now this one's hanging over a little bit. I can, I'll can i go back and fix that. Uh, go ahead and set your new wall height here as well. And you can see it says up to level roof. I set that for 10 feet already, so it's good. I actually don't have to change my wall height. Uh, I don't like how... Let me erase that. That was me doing some copy and paste earlier. Okay. This wall here is hanging over just a little bit. So I can drag it in and kind of fine tune it. And that looks pretty good there. So now I've got my second level. And when you want to add your floors and stuff here, make sure you work on second level. And let's see what happens here. Just add a floor here. So above the uh, kitchen. And then you'll go from there and add your second story. Decide how many bedrooms you want. If you want a um, extra bathroom up there, then you want to put your windows in. And I'll do that. Um, Try and line them up as best you can to make everything look symmetrical. You know, if you got a bedroom here and you're going to put a window in your bathroom, it might be a good idea to line them up. So that's how you add stairs and also make a second floor.